All right, on to the next deck. We got a rudimentary beat. I used to play a lot of Miracle Rogue back in the day, and currently have been play a lot of Oil and Malagos Rogue. I'm looking for a good combo deck to try and hit Legend with. Could you build a viable combo deck and play it on stream? A viable combo deck. Any combo that can hit Legend. Man, the Druid combo. What are you talking about, rudimentary beat? Force of Nature, Savage Roar. That combo's sick. Have you seen it before? It's really good. Really good. Really, really good. Um, I gotta think. What kind of? There's like, if you, there's obviously the like Reno combo locks. There's Patron combos. Have you seen the new Patron combos? These might be new to you. I don't know if you've seen what people have been doing with Patron lately, but that's they're bringing it back. It's a lot like, I didn't say it's a lot like Miracle Rogue, it's a lot like old Patron, but I mean, like, Patron combo decks are uh, a thing now that people are trying to make tier one. So let me just show you some sort of Patron combo y goodness. You got the shield blocks back in now. You got the charge for the combo. Shield blocks for draw and like staying alive. Cause now you're trying to combo people out. You forgot the rampage. You gotta get the rampage in there. Where's rampage? Mm -hmm. Yeah, work and patron combo. That's what people do now for patron. At least some people have been trying it over the last few days. There's been a lot of people hitting legend with it. And they're saying it's the way of the patron future. So, and then you got like this in there, you got ye old emperor, and uh, orange from Team Archon played a list similar to this to Legend, and uh, LOK Shadow played uh, the combo patron to Legend, I believe. So, people have been playing this to Legend, it's a combo deck. Need to acolyte of pain is what we're missing. Only one Lotheb. What am I missing? Uh, battle rages. Battle rages. Battle rage. And unstable ghoul. Now the frothing's got taken out. The frothings got taken out in favor of more draw and the combo that kills people. He didn't ask for rogue? No, he just asked for a combo deck. He said he's played a lot of rogue, he wants to play a different combo deck. So I don't think he wants to play rogue. I don't know, did you want to play rogue, man? Hey, he just says he meant any combo. So I think I think this is more what he's looking for. A rude inventory beat. Well, the combo in here is a uh, raging worgen charge, inner rage rampage. So we get it up to four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then hit him for twenty-two. So it's a good old twenty-two damage combo to try and kill people with. If we don't get the inner rage in there, it's four less, so it's only eighteen. But eighteen's not so bad. I mean, they're trying to remove every combo from the game, so when there's uh, when they're trying to remove every combo deck from the game, it's a lot harder to find combo decks that are pure combo. I don't. The only pure combo deck left really is Freeze Mage, right? Or maybe Combo yeah. Warlock is kind of a pure combo deck, but most combos that deal thirty damage have been removed. Alright, I like Slam. I don't really like the other cards, but Slam can sometimes kill a 3-2, clean that sort of mess up. I think the other cards are good enough. We gotta find our weapons early game. Kinda like Patron. Cause we're Patron. Beautiful. I don't think we need to coin the X out. Because we don't need to slam an axe in the same turn, so it's fine. We can just wait for him to do something. Axe is something. Terrific. 
Oh, dude, we might just be able to patron and win. Beautiful. If he's freeze mage, he's toast because we got like two shield blocks. <laughs> All right, he's not freeze mage. He's freezing my face though. All right, this is what we keep this card for, so it's a good thing we got it. So we could coin armor if we wanted to play around counter spell, but I don't. Terrific. So we got this mirror entity. Got this mirror entity, huh? How are we beating mirror entity? Oh, that's awkward too. Ah, damn Annoyatron. What a headache. I guess we're just gonna give him a no mission venter. We're gonna need a whirlwind. Real bad. Could have armor passed, I guess. I don't know how much I like just armor passing, but definitely don't really want to use any of these. Put a shield blocked, to be honest with you. I kind of want to play Lothab next turn, though, and I eventually want to play the Patron, so I eventually have to beat the Mirror Entity. I'm not really going to find anything other than this to beat through it. That trade for me. Really happy about that. Mm, no whirlwind. I do like just slamming Loth up here. Next turn we can kind of go off on patrons because we have patron inner rage coin cruel taskmaster. Get a few patrons in play. Flamewaker on my Loth up turn. Alternatively, we can just kill that flame waker. Shield block first. Armor Smith's pretty sweet. I definitely want to kill that flame maker, huh? Yeah, I think I want to get this armor smith down. Um, we could save the execute and use the inner rage or the cruel taskmaster to get through that. Pop the Divine Shield and then whack it. And then just trade the Flame Waker so we still have. Oh, yeah, that's probably better. Back to work. I kind of want to Shield Block this turn. Nah, I can just armor, I think. This way we have Execute for his turn 7 play. Because he's been holding a lot of cards, so that means he either gets. Burn in his hand, or he has, uh, what's that called? He's either got burn in his hand, or he has a 7 drop, so we're gonna hold on to the execute, so we're prepared for that 7 drop. 7 drop is flame strike. That's new. Alright, we're a whirlwind away from victory. There's a whirlwind. Well, now we only lose to, like, double fireball, huh? I guess I kind of want to kill one of these, but not really. He has to kind of trade him off unless he can clear both patrons. I could coin armor though. Hopefully we're able to find another way to activate execute. Or at least have the patrons in the field, you know. But yeah, those neither, neither of those have three attacks, so they have to trade into my patrons anyway. So I don't want to execute. I think I'm just going to coin armor though. Armor's good, man. Armor's good. Hopefully we're able to find a battle rage, get some draw going, get towards our worgen combo. Hit him for 22 and kill him. <laughs> the dream. Alright, he's coming off face. Double fireball doesn't quite kill me. He's trying to set up the lethal for next turn. Fireball looked weird while I was floating through the air. Let's see what we can find here. Emperor, no help. Uh, we just make patrons off his guys and armor out. No need to enter rage. We can save it for the Worgen combo. Mm, 
as soon as we find charge, we'll be in business. We can get this up to four, six, seven, eight, sixteen damage with charge. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. Charge is lethal. Mm -hmm. Man, these major powers look weird as shit, dude. <laughs> All right, so we want to execute. Um. Yeah, this is the executing patron. Let's just cash that bad boy in today. I want to save the inner age. Go with the patron comb. I mean, go with the. Yeah, you guys did it. Alright, we'll just, like, bounce on him. Alright, that one died. Bounce on this one. Man, Boombots are evil. Get that out there. Be okay. <sighs> you require my oh, assistance. Jesus. Why does it hurt so bad? Aha. Now he's got double fireball again. Oh, good battle rage. Uh, we can draw two cards. We have 14 left. Do we want to draw three cards? I don't think so. I think it's okay just to draw two. I don't know. I'm scared. Alright, let's draw three. Let me break up our Worgen stuff. I guess we have board. We don't really want the Worgen combo anymore. I just want to finish him, honestly. I just find armor gain and do this the correct way. There's an execute. There's a whirlwind. Another battle rage. Alright, let's find some more armor gain. Let me go, let's not fatigue ourselves to death. Alright, we got Worgen Charge. Whirlwind to inner rage it. 5, 10, 16. And this goes up to 4, 6, 12. 16 plus 12 is enough. Hopefully it is. Um. If it's not, this is kind of awkward. Got there. Ugh. Beautiful. So yeah, it's like this. Yeah, this deck is was able to reach a... Uh, um, Deck was able to reach legendary status for a few players. There's a lot of versions floating around there. Some people have been using cards like Alex Straza has been thrown in the mix. And then they don't even run like the Worgen, some of them. They just run the Alex Straza charge combo. And then that sort of evolved into people cutting or adding the Worgen in over the Frothings because they already have the charge. They're like, might as well just throw the Worgen in there. And then that evolved into people cutting the Alex, and now it's just the Worgen combo. So, personally, I think Alex is a little bit too slow for the meta, but if you want to be with the Alex, be with the Alex. It's, people have been playing around with it. There's no refined list yet for this sort of idea, the combo patron, but it's going to be coming to tournaments probably pretty soon, because there's a lot of people doing pretty well with it on ladder, and uh, a lot of lists floating around, and a lot of people playing with it. So I guarantee you, in whatever the next Hearthstone tournament is, there's going to be this sort of patron list making an appearance, and then it's going to be all over ladder, and then we're back in the patron meta. So I hope you guys are excited for that. Anyway, um, let's see, next deck, so I hopefully that helped you, Rudimentary Beat, good combo deck there, alright, we have two decks remaining, two decks remaining, um, I guess I'll, I'll leave this deck list up and then be right back really quick, and then we'll get to those last two decks of the evening. <laughs> 